Hi everyone, welcome back to the MRKWP YouTube channel. I'm Matthew, the founder of MRKWP, and today I'm gonna to show you how to add product attributes in WooCommerce to the product details page. So they're not shown in tabs, but they're shown directly below the description and where you would do an add to cart. I'm using the Bloxy theme. Let's jump on in and I'll show you how to add that code. Okay, so in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to add product attribute data just here inside the details of a Bloxy theme. Uh, this should work with any WooCommerce site though. So what are type of attributes we're looking at? Custom attributes. So we can see that we've got these sizes here of one liter and five liter that should be visible on the product page. And at this point in time, that's not showing up because I've turned tabs off on this particular design. So I take my code snippet, uh, there's a link in the description below for this. And I'm gonna copy that. And then I'm gonna go into appearance, my theme file editor, and I've got a child theme here for my theme functions from my functions.php. I'm just gonna paste that in. And what this says is for the WooCommerce product meta start function, get the global product namespace and then echo out all the product attributes and I just go update like that. That file has now been updated. Go back into my product page and refresh and there we can see that that's showing up. And let's just do another attribute here. So I'm just gonna add another one and I'm just gonna say this is a test attribute like that. Testing value like that. Save attributes. There we go. Update the product just to be sure. That's good and then refresh here. And we can see I've got my testing attribute there. That's all shown up, that looks good. And then we're gonna go back to my attributes and so now I'm gonna remove that, okay. And go update. Go back to attributes, let's make sure that's all there, it is. Go back here and refresh and we can see it's now gone. So what I also did inside of here is I just added a little bit of CSS. So inside my child theme for my style.css, I added in this little bit of code here, margin bottom 35 pixels. What that did is just gave it a little bit more space before my categories were right up against the bottom. Now they're not. So that's a great little tip for anybody wanting to add attributes into the description area on their WooCommerce products. All right, well, I hope you liked that tip and that's a little tick in one extra bit of skill that you've got for your WooCommerce product pages. If you liked this, feel free to subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to like it. Let me know in the comments if there was anything that you wanted more help with around WooCommerce and particularly on the Bloxy theme, we'd be happy to help you out. I'll see you in the next video.